Post-traumatic stress disorder, PTSD, is a psychiatric condition rooted in profound alterations of the brain's fear and memory circuits. At its core, PTSD involves three key brain structures, the amygdala, the hippocampus, and the prefrontal cortex. In individuals with PTSD, the amygdala, responsible for detecting threats, is hyperactive, leading to exaggerated fear responses and hypervit. This heightened activity is not balanced by the prefrontal cortex, which typically acts as a regulator of emotional responses. In PTSD, the prefrontal cortex shows reduced activity, impairing the brain's ability to distinguish between actual danger and safe environments. This imbalance explains why trauma survivors may respond to harmless cues as though they were life-threatening. The hippocampus, which governs contextual memory and helps differentiate past from present, is often reduced in volume in PTSD patients. This structural change contributes to flashbacks and intrusive memories as the brain struggles to properly encode and separate traumatic experiences from current reality. Disruptions are observed in both the glutamatergic and serotonergic systems, as well as heightened activity in the stress hormone pathway, particularly cortisol. The development of PTSD is heavily shaped by childhood and environmental factors. Early exposure to trauma, such as abuse, neglect, or unstable attachment, primes the stress response system, lowering the threshold for later PTSD development. Repeated or prolonged trauma alters, making the fear circuits of the brain hypersensitive and less capable of recovery. Conversely, Protective factors, such as stable caregiving and consistent emotional validation, can buffer against trauma's impact. Even in genetically predisposed individuals, ultimately, PTSD represents the brain's survival machinery turned against itself. The amygdala remains locked in alarm mode. The hippocampus fails to anchor the memory in the past, and the prefrontal cortex loses its capacity to calm the storm. This neurobiological constellation explains why trauma is not merely remembered, it is relived. If you want more deep dives into psychology, subscribe and share your friends this video so you don't miss the next one.